going extra large okay. this morning, Megan, because it is it is gloomy. It's like kind of drizzly yeah. and damp out there this morning. It's breezy, so that's just making it feel even cooler. So a nice extra large hot cup of coffee. Dare I say, go get one of the holiday flavors from Starbucks because they are out. Can you believe it? We are already getting close to Christmas time. And I know some of y'all already have your Christmas trees up, okay? Don't even lie about it. I know you have them up. Extra large cup of coffee, 50s, cool and damp and breezy. We do have some light rain out there. I have you zoomed in closer to Metro here. Uh, Megan was talking about that airport camera looking kind of wet. Yeah, we do have some light rain that just moved over Hartsfield Jackson. Some rain moving inside the perimeter into Atlanta, into parts of uh, eastern Cobb County, so the Mableton and Smyrna area, also over into Cab County, Rockdale and Newton County. Very light rain. You might even be just noticing that in the form of drizzle. A lot of that might not be steadily making it to the ground. Temperatures in the upper 50s to low 60s. It is chilly out there, and the morning will carry the best coverage of rain. We'll take you through first alert future cast here. Between now and 10 a.m., we'll keep that chance for light scattered showers very similar to what first alert radar is looking like right now going through the afternoon you'll notice cloud cover stays on thick today it'll stay fairly overcast it will feel misty through the day we have a wedge building in and when you have a lot of moisture in place as those wedges build in it will feel misty out there temperatures in the upper 50s to low 60s that is it so we will hover in the upper 50s to low 60s all day today going into the evening tonight if you do have any evening plans a few light showers will be possible ahead of a cold front that will start to bring some heavier rain tomorrow morning Morning. Here's a look at 6 a.m. Heavy rain for the mountains. Temperatures in the low 60s. Heading into your morning commute tomorrow around 8 o'clock. Notice some patchy heavy downpours will be possible north of the city from Blairsville into LJ. Maybe even as far south as Canton and Gainesville. Atlanta and areas south stay dry. That front continues to move in through the afternoon and we'll actually see sunshine in the afternoon. And temperatures will tap out in the mid 70s. So by late morning for a lot of the Veterans Day parades, we should be mostly dry. And then the afternoon will shape up beautifully. Rainfall Total wise, of course, the heavier rain north of the city, and you can see that in the numbers close to an inch of rain possible in Canton and Rome, maybe three tenths of an inch in LJ. I think that could be higher, but we're still looking for more than a trace of rain for the city of Atlanta. Maybe Thursday. That's our next cold front. Models are struggling with this. But it does look like we might have that moisture return we need to give us a chance for scattered showers. We'll keep a 30% coverage for now, but we'll be keeping an eye on Thursday behind that front. We drop back to average mid 40s, maybe even some low 40s Friday morning. Beautiful afternoon sunshine and upper 60s, and then it looks like we'll warm back into the low 70s to start next weekend. Oh,